Hobbies for adults and kids. Now drones are part of a club at an elementary school in the West End. Angela Ingram shows us how volunteers are helping children take a high-tech approach to learning. A tiny drone captivates a small group of students. They're in an after-school club at Hayes Porter Elementary, and these small flying wonders are the latest thing the kids are learning. It has four propellers, four motors. It actually has a camera in the front. The camera then transmits a video signal back to a set of goggles that the pilot would wear. The children are in the computer robotics club. Oh, he's about to fly it again. Oh, that's pretty cool. It's a program that teaches computer programming and how to build robots. Now they're taking the class to new heights. The first time we brought in the drone and we flew it around the room, I was amazed at how quiet they all were. They were all just in shock. And, uh, you know, to them it's magic, but it's really not. It's just technology, and that's what we're trying to show them. <laughs> Volunteers work with the children. The adults want younger kids to be exposed to technology early on. They need to understand that, you know, if they can, you know, learn it now and learn as they go through school and, you know, take computer science classes at a young age, they, that really opens up their, their future quite a bit. And the kids are excited to expand their minds. They all have a favorite thing to learn. I like being robots. How to type and making robots and making these. Right now, the club only well, meets on window. Mondays and Wednesdays, but the volunteers want it to grow. There's nothing like seeing joy on a child's face, especially when they see all of their hard work pay off. Because I built the right and it worked and stuff my first time. In the West End, Angela Ingram, Local 12 News. An organization called Families Forward oversees the program. Families Forward also gives kids in the club a snack and dinner from the free store food bank. Another program.